Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Try me if you. I know it's been a while. Um, school has been kicking my butt lately, so yeah. But today, um, I'm gonna be doing a Christmas guide or Christmas wish list for all the teens out there, and personally, what I want. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. My name's Ify. If you're not, you already know what to do. Let's just get right into this video. Reading off my MacBook. Let's start with technology. The first thing is is an iPhone 11. Honestly, who would say no to that? Like who wouldn't? I'm pretty sure they're like they're not up to a thousand. I'm pretty sure they're not. I think the iPhone 11 is like 600. I I think so. The next thing is AirPods. I feel like a hypocrite. Like I really feel like a hypocrite because when it came out, the way I was talking so bad about these, I was like they're useless. I'm gonna lose them, all that kind of stuff. And here I am finding ways to save up money to get an AirPod. Like if you really think about it, they're in good use. So like, yeah, AirPods. It's a yes, ma'am. It's a yes. Get AirPods, get AirPods. Like they have newer versions. I just forgot what they're called. Air Pro, AirPod 2, I, I don't know. But they have like three versions, three generations. The next thing is the MacBook Air. Um, before, we, before I tell y'all about the MacBooks, don't make the mistake I did. Cause I got a, mm, mm, I have MacBook Pro and it's 2010. And don't, don't, don't. I'm begging you, do not. Make sure you know which one you're getting before you actually get a MacBook. If you're new to like getting MacBooks, you don't know like, oh, what's this and what's that? What kind of version is this? Please find help. Cause don't make the mistake I did. But um, yeah, there's MacBook Air. But if you know anybody that wants a MacBook so bad, I recommend getting the MacBook Air 2017 at least. I don't freaking know. I'm not a Apple expert. Next thing is Polaroid cameras. At first I thought there was no use in that. I've seen them before, but I'm just like, what is this? What is it? And they're pretty cheap, like 50, 70 something at least. But like, they're kind of cute. If you want like vintage pictures, I mean, that's your thing or whatever, I recommend that. Next thing is Canon G7. And when I tell you I've been wanting this, I like, I'm planning and need a, that camera really hits like, oh my God. I see people with them. The way it just looks so good is the focus is on you, especially for those YouTubers out there that want to start. I'm not saying just go straight into a camera, but if you have the money for it, okay, yeah, then go for it. You know, that camera is pretty good. Uh, tripods, Um, this is really good for like, if you want to go somewhere like traveling, like tripods can go anywhere with it. It's pretty lightweight. It's really good, especially if you're trying to be a vlogger, stuff like that. This is good in use. Now, Disney Plus is literally only like, what, six, seven dollars a month. I, I mean, I'm not, I don't know if I'm lying. I think it's like seven dollars a month. This shows from what, 2009 to even, I think it's later than that. That's another recommendation. So we're gonna head out with the shoes. We're gonna start with the Air Force ones, the white ones specifically. I've been wanting those shoes since like last year. And they're not that okay. I lied. They're at least a hundred plus tax. No, they're at least ninety six. At least or ninety dollars plus tax would be at least a hundred online. Another one is Crocs. Crocs are the thing now. I'm sorry. Like I will get Crocs any day, any time. Yeah, but I suggest y'all get gibbets with that. You know, make it cute, make it stylish. UGG slide. I think they're usually called UGG yeah slide, something like that. If you want to be on the creative side, get the custom ones. There's, there's a lot of people that make custom UGG slides. And the fishy thing about it is like, is it real? Is it not real? But I don't want to push y'all there. So I'm just, yeah, I'll just show y'all some pictures. But they have a lot of colors. I like, they have certain colors. You can get some from North Storm, if that's what it's called. Zappos, the UGG website. And last but not least, I don't know how y'all say this stuff. I just call them AJ ones. Don't come for me, don't come for me. I'll show you the picture of the ones that I have. I suggest y'all get that, but they're up to like probably at least 116 the orange ones that i got some of them are more expensive than the others and some of them are cheaper depending on your size and depending on the color so now heading out with the accessories these are for the girls mostly first we have rings james avery is a good um website to get rings at pandora and that's all i know next is bracelet i don't know how it works because i never got one before 
but I suggest y'all should get charm bracelets, especially from Pandora or James Avery. Next thing is custom necklaces. There's a lot on AliExpress. The catch to this is that it takes a long time. It's like, what, a month to actually get to Houston from China, I believe, or from wherever it's coming from. I can't really think of any other websites. If I can later on, I'll put them down in the description. Head on to makeup. This is mostly for the girls, but hey if you like lashes and concealers or foundation boys this is for you too we're gonna head on with the lashes first okay i have a couple websites that i know that have good lashes these vendors i will say vendors i guess what they're vendors there's this website called so sophia lashes she's really good i have one but they messed up so i'm about to get another pair so sophialashes.com i'll put the link down in the description i don't know how to say her name Please correct me if I'm wrong, I'm so sorry. But it's Nonye's lashes. Those lashes are pretty cute too. Um, I think they're both, I think they both have 3D, no, I lied. 25 mm lashes or 3D mink lashes, either one. Their lashes are usually like eight to 12, I believe. So, but they're pretty good lashes. Like, you will not regret it if you get lashes from them. I'm not even lying, like I'm not joking. I'm gonna put the link down in the description. Now, if you're on a budget with lashes, um, I suggest you go to the beauty supply store. These lashes are from beauty supply store. Like, I'm so for real. I will put the link down in the description too, so I can show y'all the actual lashes I'm wearing right now from the beauty supply store. And they sell out quick, so I suggest y'all get those. Now we're gonna head out with foundation. If you're a kind of girl that loves to put foundation on, or you know a girl that loves to put foundation like crazy, you're in the right place. The first foundation that I recommend, if you're trying to go for like a little high and good quality foundation, I recommend Juvia's Place. Their foundation is top notch. And next is lip gloss. You can't go wrong with lip gloss. I mean, if you want the high end, those quality, top notch quality lip glosses, there's some from Fenty Beauty. And I recommend that because they're worth the hype. They're really good. If you're on a budget, there's lip glosses. I'm gonna put them up because I don't really remember them. I guess that's all. If y'all really enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on your post notifications. I'll see y'all next time. Bye.